Hello and welcome back to the Banner Saga. Um, you recall we have a pretty important decision to make, whether we want to fight with Faso on the bridge, or get rid of it. Or just leave. The third option is just get out of here. Uh, forget about their business. I think what I would like to do is I would like to make one fight here. Um, just to see if I can buy enough time for us to learn anything more about Ivor. They don't have enough information. I don't want to leave them here. I think we'll fight on the bridge. Good to have Ivan still with us. Basel is injured. I don't have Ivor, which make this fight a very interesting one. We're gonna put in Gil because he's our default. Uh, of course, we're gonna have him. We're gonna we, we will use can we use Krumer. I think I can only use five. No, I can use six. Okay, let's go with this. Somebody else can equip this item here, and I think I will give it to Ejo. Let's do this. Nobody's doing particularly well. Okay, let's see here. 16, 12, 13. There's a slinger over here. As usual, what I would like to do is to focus on one side or another. So there's two approach here. The first one is we go to this side and then deal with this these two which have high this guy has very high attack and then try to take him out very quickly. Or we go to this side and then buy us more time against those two because he doesn't do a huge amount of damage immediately um, and his friends aren't particularly intimidating. And we can clump them up. The problem is I don't have a pretty good, real good tank. I have these two, which have any sort of decent armor. And neither of them are particularly... Uh, how should I say it? Well, I take that back. I was going to say neither of them are particularly tough, but Ejo is pretty tough because he has Stonewall. So I think we'll do this. I don't think they can reach us quite yet. I hope I'm not mistaken. But at least... At least he won't be able to reach us. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, he cannot reach. These cannot reach. Who's going first? He is gonna go first. But he can't do anything, so he just waits a turn and then he will go and then the slinger. Okay. Slinger doesn't act for a little bit. So I wonder if I should go after him instead. Hmm. Decisions. Not a good, real good at them, I'm afraid. This 
slinger or I would like to take the slinger. Okay, perfect. Let's do this. Those guys are ages away from getting to us. So I did that because that allows me to put an armor on him. Let's do some shield breaking. He comes after Idro. Like he can't do anything except for shield damage. And then we're gonna wail on him with Kumer and then um, our f your f your friend and mine. But what I think I will do now because he doesn't move for a long. I take that back. I was gonna say he doesn't move for a long time, but he does. Udo will get a turn before him though, let's see. Rook will get a turn before him. And then Ijo will get another turn, so I think we're okay. I don't want to use Mand yet. Since it's not quite necessary. Since I will be able to Mand for 4 armor damage and... Well, you know what? It's fine, I don't care. Should do it. Rook doesn't have um, the penetrate ability. So there's really no, there's no good or bad thing whether he moves or not. The only consideration I have is whether I want to have him attack or I want to have a LUT attack. But I think this is fine. That's not a particularly bad problem at this point. They both of them are pretty much incapacitated. Since there's nothing useful for me to do right now, I'm gonna have him rest to get my willpower back. Let's see here, what do I want to do? Luke is coming up next. I want his turn because he has the greatest potential to do armor damage. But I don't want to move him too quickly because he will be able to get in the way and cause a lot of issues. Okay. 
Let's do this. Make him easier to kill, in case I need to. have to think about which direction he's going to go. These guys aren't going to be able to make it to my side for a long time. So I, he will either come this way and he will come this way or they will come this way. Um, if they come this way, I need to retreat both of my archers. But I have time. Let's go here. I'm going to try to bet that they come in this direction. He didn't do anything. He just blocked everybody, which is very convenient. Let's just do one. I think that's enough. Six, four. They're acting soon. That's a pretty good development, I have to say. Uh, I can thread a needle, but I don't think it's going to do anything for me. I can take him down a little bit more, but he doesn't act until Rook does. I think what I want to do is spend some time getting rid of this guy's shield. Okay. Time to do more mending. Gonna play this real defensively. Next turn, he will be able to reach over here. He can't reach anybody yet. He's blocked. But I'm not sure how long he will stay blocked because the archers will move. I could come over there and start wailing away on, on the armor of him, but I'm not sure if I want to expose myself that much quite yet. Ah, uh, that put him in so much danger though. Not sure if I'd like to do that. This is just a mess of things right now. I need to disable as many of these as possible before the, the artillerists get close, in a way of speaking. I have 3 armor break, I can do 4 armor damage. But... Okay, I see what I can do. I'm gonna hang here a little bit longer. No, I don't want to do that. So dangerous. Because I want to go here. This is what I want to do. But if the archer, the slinger moves, then this dude might come and wreck me. But I'm going to make this choice. Actually, that's a bad choice. I forgot about the, uh, the target. Well, too late now. One damage. That's fine. We'll take that. 
He's moving next, but Rook will be able to take him. I don't want to come here, partly because that blocks the escape route for our friend. But I'm going to do this, because he didn't move. Alright. You need to die right now. He is acting soon. 13, okay. I will come over here. That gives an extra armor. And take down a little more of his shield. Okay. Probably the best I could have hoped for. It's not a whole lot, but we have to do it. Hmm. I wonder why the... Puncture didn't... Didn't trigger, I'm not sure. Because she didn't move. Let's do a little bit of mending, uh, our friend here. Yeah. You done trapped. And now, because he's not moving for a while, I will switch my target over here. And do some armor damage this way. which completely blocks him off. And he can't reach anybody, so I can have another turn of wait before I need to do anything. Let's do more armor damage. Still stuck, it's just wobbling around in the back. 13. Can't catch anybody yet. Okay. Be careful here. Just be just for safety, I'm gonna stonewall. He retreated. That's not great. You're next. And then after you, it's our friend. Hmm. We need to be able to do more damage to him right now. Let's go here. Ah, uh, it's just not. Okay, let's do it. Okay. I think it's time to go into some sort of offense mode here. If I remember correctly, the arc lightning hits at diagonal units. Let's find out how this works. It just could be the most horrible thing, but... I'm interested. Hold on one second here. 
for two strength to continue to do damage. Okay, so it doesn't. It's actually not particularly productive to try to do any more than this, the first most basic one. I don't know why he did that. That seems pretty dumb to me if you ask me. Nobody asked me. Not his turn for a while. Not his turn for a while. His turn, but he can't do anything. Perfect. I am enjoying where this is going. I have to say. Take him out right now. 13 and 22. That 22 is gonna come back and really bite me in a while since I haven't done anything. But he's still not in range. Alright, let's take him out. Means he'll get closer to me. Not safe. Definitely not safe. Yeah, that's the, you know that's the trouble. If I go after him now, I need to like seriously go after him. Should I do that? Yes, let's do it. Like they say, no pain, no gain. That's actually pretty bad. Okay, come over here, do another stone wall. Hopefully they don't get lucky. Nope, they got lucky. I can do 20 damage to him. 20! That's craziness. If I go this way, I can do 10 to them both. And the reason I'm doing this is because I want to delay the guy in the back for one more turn. Okay, he can't reach Ijo, so he's gonna probably go after him. That 22 damage is just ridiculous. Okay, one second. Let me read the description. Restore armor equals to current willpower plus one. Alright, let's do two. That should get him back to full. No, it doesn't. Should have done the first. No, it's just us archers now. Is it time to start wiping everybody out? Let's do it. Why not? Good time as any, that's what I say. Alright, you're dead. Can't reach anybody, so 
I'm actually gonna rest just to restore a little bit of sanity here. That did a huge amount of damage to him. I don't like that at all. I think he's going to be successful, since I can't stop him. No, he is back. Oh wait, interesting. That's fine. We're gonna rest. The dreaded square formation. It's interesting to note that even after he summoned correctly, or he summoned, we still have. Just go for it. We still have the pillage. Goodbye, babies. And with that, happy ending. Got very careless toward the end there, and then lost uh, lost Ijo to a silly mistake. That's all? So we just sit here and fight indefinitely? Or we can just leave? Let's check our heroes real quick. I kind of don't want to keep fighting because everybody's getting injured. Next fight, I will be basically without a single tank. All of them are not doing super well. I don't know when I get Ivor back. Let me promote some people first. I have enough to do it, it seems. Okay. Get a little more odd life. Oh, let's see what other choices we have. We can also promote Alette. Oh, I'm short by one to do both. Rook, I don't think I can do it yet. No, I can't. Do I want to get Rook to 5? He's not quite enough. I can't promote both Alet and Odd Life. Let's, uh, let's do this. She's the big hitter for us. We need her to get as much as we possibly can. I don't have enough here. Just one more. Just one stinking more right now. That's all I need. Oh well, anyway. We will make that decision next time. Or as if the Varls say it, we'll cross that bridge as we come to it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.